Yo, what's going on guys? In today's video, we're going to be using one of the most underrated decks in Clash Royale. We got the first match. Today, we're running Hog Rider Mini P.E.K.K.A. with the Rocket. This deck is so good now that the Monk and Phoenix got nerfed. Perfect time for the deck to shine. I'm going to go with the Princess right at the bridge. One of the main ways to get damage with this deck. A bit dirty, but that was almost like 500 damage right off the bat. This guy could be running a Mega Knight Wallbreakers deck. I'll go with my Ice Golem onto his Bandit. We do have Mini P.E.K.K.A. as well, so it's fine to waste it. He's going to Musk on the left side. I'll go with the Hog on the right. Just try to split up his Elixir. He will Mega Knight. Still one nice Hog Rider shot. Looking pretty good so far. I'll go with my Bats on the left and then a Mini P.E.K.K.A. for his Mega Knight. Honestly, a pretty good Miner by him. Wait, this could be trouble. I'm going to go with my Ice Golem in the middle. Maybe try to get a King Tower activation. No Mega Knight! Oh! Oh, let's go. That was so clean. Dang. I'm going to go with the Hog Rider right at 4. He only has Bats in Cycle. He has the Bats onto it, but it should still be 2 shots. It's definitely not a good game just yet, but looking really good. I'm going to go with the Bats. I'll also Log. I knew he was going to try to zap me. Almost a perfect defense, only one wall breaker. I'll go with the princess here. Some more free tower damage. And we can just go with the ice golem for his bandit. Beautiful start. That was such a clutch defense against his mega knight bandit push earlier. King tower activation will help out quite a bit in this matchup as well. Feeling pretty good about this. I can definitely start to just go with my rockets on his towers if I need to. He's going to minor. I'll go with my mini P.E.K.K.A. on it. I didn't want to, but I don't want to eat a full Miner at the same time. He will Mega Knight. Okay, guys. We can just Rocket that. Free uh, almost 600 tower damage, and his Mega Knight is already pretty low on HP. Not low, but only half HP by now. I'm going to go with the Bats up high. Force out the Zap. I'll take that. I'm going to go with the Ice Golem. This could be a little bit bad. Uh, going to log everything. We might be in a bit of trouble right now. I'll go with my Bats, too. Could have been worse, honestly, but not ideal. Oh, one bat connected. I'm going to go with the Fire Spirit. He will Musketeer. He has no log in his deck, so I can just go with my Princess. Nice mini P.E.K.K.A. predicting his Miner. Okay, we're still looking pretty good so far. Just have to be a bit careful of these bandits, especially. He's going to Mega Knight in the back. I'll take the free rocket once again. <laughs> this guy just never learns. Mega Knight players are Mega Knight players, though. I'm going to log back his Mega Knight so the bats go in front, hopefully. I'll also Fire Spirit. Okay, I kind of just failed that Fire Spirit. It's fine, though. Okay, I'm going to go with the log. We might be in trouble again. Uh, Fire Spirit. Okay, Fire Spirit does prevent the Mega Knight from jumping on the tower, at least. Wait, no. The bats. Wait, Hog Rider. Hog Rider. Please take it. Good game. It's time, but do you know what time it is? It's spiriting time. I'll go with my Ice Golem plus Hog Rider on the right side. I already know that this guy loves to play Lumberloon Freeze. It's always better to pair your Hog Rider with an Ice Golem if you know your opponent has a deck with Tornado. Pretty good damage to start off with. I'll go for the Bats onto his Inferno Dragon. This will be an interesting matchup. We do have Rocket for his Balloon, but... It is kind of hard to stop all of his heavy units like the Bowler, Lumberjack, Electro Dragon pushes. Interesting Lumberjack. I'll just go for the Mini P.E.K.K.A. onto it. He's going to Balloon as well. I can just go with the Rocket. I do have to be a bit careful because the Lumberjack does now kill the Bats with its Death Spawn Rage. He's going to Bar Barrel here. I don't want to waste my Log on defense, so I'll just go with the Hog Rider to pull back this Barb. He will Bowler, but I think we should get one shot still. Really good start for us, actually. And I'll just go with the bats on his bowler. Should fully counter it unless he tries to play something onto it. The bats are still really good in this matchup. He always has to overcommit on them to kill them with like a NATO or something. Alright, so really good start, but it will be very hard in double elixir. He's going to Inferno Dragon. I can just go with the Ice Golem onto it. He's going to Lumberjack as well. Okay, I'll just go with the Princess, maybe get back to my bats as quickly as I can. I do have to rocket his balloon though. Uh, Inferno Dragon, please, no. 
Okay, I'm gonna go with the bats. I don't trust him. Okay. I thought he would try to freeze my tower or something. That could have been a lot worse, honestly. I kind of want an Ice Golem plus Hog Rider. But I'll just go with the lone Hog Rider instead, because Ice Golem plus Hog Rider is so bad when they go with the Bowler onto it. I'll Princess the Bridge too, just try to get some nice chip damage. One of my only ways to get damage in this matchup, unless he makes a misplay. Really good damage. It's so crazy how Princess gets that much damage at the bridge sometimes. He's gonna bowler in the back. I can't really do anything about it though. That's the hard part about this matchup. He's gonna E-drag too. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna possibly stop all of this stuff. I'll just go with my princess in the left lane. He will balloon in the back. Okay, I'll just go with my uh, rocket here on everything. Really good timing. He wasted the lumberjack at the same time. I'll go with my hog to pull back this inferno dragon. Probably bait out a tornado as well. So I can go with my bats on his balloon. Wait no, princess stop his inferno dragon. No, it has 1 HP, bro. Okay, I'm gonna go with the Ice Golem plus Hog Rider. Man, that balloon did so much damage. Okay, Ice Golem Death Nova hit his bowler. We do get one Hog Rider shot. I think I need like three logs and a rocket to finish off his tower. That'll be pretty hard to get off though. I'm gonna go with the rocket on defense here against his balloon and the Ice Golem for his bowler. Okay. Not really sure how I'm going to break through at this point. I'll just go with the Hog Rider and cycle another log. Wait, that was such a bad NATO. That was a horrible NATO. That should get one shot, right? Let's go. Okay, Rocket. He's dead. Good game. That's how you destroy Lumberloon Freeze players. We got the next match up against this guy. I'll go with the Bridge Princess first play. One of the best starting plays for this deck, besides Fire Spirit or Hog Rider. I'll go with the Bridge Fire Spirit now. You guys can always play the Ice Spirit instead, but Fire Spirit is super nice to get the extra tower damage, and it's also better against Swarm decks. I'll split my bats right now and probably Hog Rider in whatever lane he doesn't play anything in. Okay, I'll just go with the Ice Golem and Hog. No reason why, I just feel like being aggressive today. <laughs> why not? He's gonna Fisherman. It does target onto my Ice Golem though, that's really good for me. That's a lot of damage. My man just lost half of his tower first play. I'll take it. I'm gonna go with the Princess. He has RG. I'll just wait a few seconds so the Fisherman doesn't pull my Mini P.E.K.K.A. And I think Mini P.E.K.K.A plus Log should almost fully kill his RG. Only gets one shot on the tower. Super good start. I'll go with another Ice Golem and the Hog Rider. Mini P.E.K.K.A got one shot on the left side. Okay, I think Fisherman is on the Ice Golem again. <laughs> Dude, I just feel bad for this guy at this point. Even the Ice Golem Death Nova hit his tower. Poor guy. I'll go with the Fire Spirit for his Fisherman. Could fully counter it. And yeah, really good start. Not really sure how I feel about this matchup, but... I'm just gonna go with the Princess at the bridge. Try to secure his tower pretty early on, so I don't really have to worry about anything. He does catch it with the Phoenix. I'll just go with the bats here onto it. Wait, no, he has Mother Witch. Guys, we're so dead. Okay, I have to go with the Mini P.E.K.K.A. No, it's running back. Uh, help me. Okay, Mini P.E.K.K.A got one shot on his Fisherman, but... Oh, no. Oh, oh, I thought the Electro Spirit hit our bats. Dude, this mother witch is going crazy right now. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna log back all these piggies. We're actually down in damage somehow. Okay. I'll go with the bridge princess. He does catch it once again. I'm gonna go with the hog rider plus bats plus ice golem on the left side. I kind of want to play opposite lane of him if possible. I can't really kill his phoenix in the same lane. He's gonna lightning. Oh, okay. I'm going to go with the Ice Golem and the Hog Rider on the left side. Okay, we just barely stopped his Fisherman in time. We do get one Hog Shot. Okay. And I'm so scared to play my bats right now. Okay, I'm going to go with them on the right side since he wasted his Mother Witch. I'll go with the Ice Golem plus Hog Rider as well. going to log away his Phoenix Egg. Wait. One Hog Rider Shot? We need one more Shot. We need one more Shot. Oh, we got it. Good game. Let's go. 
All right, boys, it's time. It's logging time. And you guys have been going crazy with the it's time comments. I'm going to go with my bridge princess here. He has zappies and the arrows. It could be a graveyard deck or a royal recruits deck. Both are pretty hard matchups. I'll just go with my ice golem in the back. I want to figure out what his final cards are. I'll go with the hog rider and the bats in case he tries to play something on it. He's going to go with the recruits all the way in the back. Super good hog rider. Beautiful timing. <laughs> he just lost half of his tower first play. Okay, this will be a bit hard to defend though. I'm going to go with the princess down low so we can't snipe it with anything. He has no arrows in cycle. Okay, I'll go with the mini P.E.K.K.A. on the left side and my log plus bats on the right side. Beautiful defense. If I do say so myself. He has the zappies onto my stuff here as well. Oh, how did that get a shot? Mini P.E.K.K.A. is so sneaky now. It always gets that extra shot, I feel like. That was crazy. Alright. I'm going to go with the Fire Spirit here. Probably bait out the E Spirit. He will Golden Knight instead, but I'll take it. I'm going to set up a Princess in the back right now. I feel like that's the key to winning this matchup. Setting up a bunch of Princesses. I'll kite his Golden Knight here with my Ice Golem. And I'll go for a Hog Rider. He has Goblin Cage, but I'll just try to go with my Log here. Push the Brawler to the side so our Hog Rider gets one shot. Little pro tip for you guys. You can always log the Cage to the side like that to get one Hog Rider shot every time. Nice fire spirit for his goblin brawler. Looking really good, but it will be really hard to defend. He's going to recruits in the back. I'll just go with the bridge princess, get onto his tower, also splash these recruits a little bit. I guess he won't play anything onto it, but it's still going to get so much damage. I'll go with the high bats here for his recruits. And I'll mini P.E.K.K.A. on the right side. Okay. Going to go with these high bats for his flying machine. He has no e-spirit in cycle. And we're defending so well this match. This is crazy, actually. I'm gonna go with the Hog Rider. His tower's already almost gone. I'll log away his Goblin Cage once again. His E Spirit does connect, though, so I think we got no shots. But it's still fine. Okay. He's gonna bridge recruits. I'll just split my bats here. Go for a Hog Rider. Pull this all back. And log on defense. Log is so good against the recruits. And I think Hog should take it. So that will be good game. We're in the next match. This guy's probably playing a log bait deck. Really good ice spirit by him. I'll just go with the fire spirit to kill his princess. I'm gonna go with the hog rider right into the goblins, unfortunately. At least he has the mighty miner too. I think he wasted that log. Wasn't even necessary. I'll kite his mighty miner with my ice golem. That's the best way to counter with this deck. Okay, so we're in the slight damage lead right now. Not by too much though, this could be a pretty hard matchup because of the Mighty Miner, mainly. I'll go with the Hog right here just to tank for his Princess, so we have to log away my Princess. Okay, I'm going to go with the Mini P.E.K.K.A. plus Fire Spirit. Okay, that just got um, messed up somehow. <laughs> okay, that's really bad. I'm going to go with my Hog here and a Prediction log onto something. We do catch his Mighty Miner. One Hog Shot, not horrible. Not horrible. Uh, I'll just go with the mini P.E.K.K.A. in the middle here. Okay, watch this, guys. Fire Spirit Ice Golem. Can fully counter the barrel. Really nice play to do when you have no log in cycle. I'll go with the Rocket onto his tower. And a Bridge Princess. Does lock onto his Princess, unfortunately, but it's still fine. I have no idea how I'm going to win this, though, at this point. I'm going to go with the mini P.E.K.K.A. in the middle. Oh, super nice mini P.E.K.K.A. Does catch his second princess. And Mini P.E.K.K.A. will kill those. Well, he is going to protect his second princess. I'm going to rocket his tower and try to get back to my log pretty quickly. Yeah, he will barrel. I can just go with the log right here. His princess did finally die. I'm going to go with the Mini P.E.K.K.A. onto his Mighty Miner. That card does so much damage. I'll also go with the Fire Spirit in case he tries to go with Goblins onto it. Oh, it splashed! Oh, mini peck on his tower. Let's go. Thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.